everybody in the vast grand internet. This is Disco Dogs back with another episode of Terraria Calamity Mod. An expert. Last episode, I made several hellstone bar items, as well as acquiring a biome blade. And starting where we left off, I am continuing a just a scan for any possible wooden chest that I might still be able to find. In hopes of finding a radar. Which I am really gonna need one. And I kinda wanna get one naturally rather than you know, unnaturally. Nothing here. Why won't you drop your item? Because wolf drum drone can drop an item that is. I don't remember what the item name is called, but I know what it looks like, and it's important. because it makes the absorber rover drive. He's only dropped by the Wolfram rover. And I really need that thing. Ooh, there's another one. I just really want to get the thing. <laughs> Is that so hard to ask? Is that so hard to get? dry there. Actually, I'm curious. Can I go down here? Do I want to see anything interesting? Don't look like it. I honestly don't know what what level um the blah 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 chest can still why am I still using trickery to fight enemies? I have a freaking biome blade making me all powerful and stuff. Why do I keep forgetting that? After all, this is my favorite weapon in the entire game. That and, uh, that and it's upgrade too. All of its upgrades. Speaking of its upgrades, that's kind of why Star Theory is very important to have. Blah 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 blah. I go up. Yep. So, Star Fury can be crafted into Arc of the Ancients in hard mode. Then, later, can become true Arc of the Ancients after Planetaria. Then, it can become Arc of the Elements. After the Moon Lord. And then I can combine it all together into Arc of the Cosmos. After. Uh, I don't quite remember which boss makes Arctic Force spawn. Uh, but it's like very late game. Extremely late game. 
After you're on. Yeah, you're on. Big dragon thingy. <sighs> and then after your run's completed, I'll actually fight the, the one boss that I have not even tried fighting at all in this entire mod. Because <laughs> a version of Calamity the mod that I am used to playing on is well the first version and there has been several updates since then but I still have not transitioned no I've never actually fought the exo bosses which is the second version and which I am now playing on Well, honestly, probably not that too good of a thing that I haven't even tried fighting the after losses on my own time. So whenever we get to that point, you'll get to see that for the first time, as, as well as me. Well, you'll get to see me experience them for the first time. Won't that be just fun? <laughs> Doesn't quite look like there's any more uh, chest happening to lie around somewhere. <sighs> Which is very unfortunate for me. See, look, it's the ocean. This ocean will eventually become a heavy grinding spot for me. <sighs> because shark. I'm gonna have to go on a giant shark hunt. That means killing all sharks and every shark I see until I hit the item I want. Unfortunately, that's probably going to take me hours of grinding to get. But in this series, I am giving you the full, unedited experience. So you will know everything is genuine. All the fear, all the terror, everything. ready to fight the Crimson, uh, Rain of Cthulhu again. Yeah, that's what it's called, Rain of Cthulhu. Just... I need to do a little prep before I continue. Oh, where's my pop? My popcorn. Oh, 
might as well just keep exploring the area here. There's a granite and a bit of a marble too. Ooh. Put some stuff away, and then I will go and face the Brian Cthulhu. But of course, before that, I'm gonna add a, another layer to my chest area. All right. there and I need more platforms. I'm gonna have to keep with the theming of this place and just use regular wood. And bam. Okay, now that I've done that, I'm gonna put these items away. And Okay, armor's in here. Weapons are in here. Oh, weapons slash tools. Equips are in here. And banners just can be thrown somewhere on the map. There we go. I'm gonna put my money away. Probably best if I build some more houses. Well, of course, before I can build some more houses, I kind of need wood. Might as well stay consistent. Hey, look, a pinky. And now it's dead. Right? I'm gonna just. Take some more trees. I, of course, will plant them back. Because I'm all about being... Being good to the environment. more wood. And I'm going to take this tree since it kind of was born without a top. And now I will replant it. Alright, I think I have enough wood now to make Two more houses. There you go. Put the stone back away. And I'm gonna make some furniture. Two doors. Two chairs. 
And two tables. <laughs> Excuse me. Share. Share. Table. Table. Door. Door. And back wall. And other back wall. And then, light source, light source, more the light sources. Perfect. And the guide's back. Great. Well, at least I know the housing is suitable. Also, I am gonna quickly just Buy a bug net. And proceed to catch all these butterflies. Before my minions just straight up kill them. Is there pretty butterflies? They're nice looking. rope anymore. I've grown past the use for it. I actually grown past the use for it quite some time ago, but never really had anything to replace its slot. So I just ended up not. Alright, I'm gonna use this chest here for fishing related stuff. Bait counts. So, other five counts. Okay. Actually, right, I said I was going to try and fight Krabulon. And I have enough going mushrooms to do so. So, I'm going to grab the fifty I need and run to the nearest demon altar. Crimson arm altar. Which is apparently down the tree. I really apologize for the noise. Ooh, ooh. Trying to, trying to just stick straight across. My name's going to be so much easier once I finally get past Moon Lord and get that compact drill thing. Ugh. It didn't have the thing. Why is it so hard to find a freaking radar? 
Alright, now I can make the the pork stick to Yeah, I have no idea how to pronounce whatever that word is. Ooh, there's another chest and it still doesn't have a radar in it. I am very sad. This also doesn't have a radar in it, which, but I really didn't expect it to. Door. Come on, there has to be a radar somewhere. I can't have to straight out spawned in a world that does not have one naturally. go as well as I hope. Throw that in there. Throw this in here. And place these down on my new row. I have a large assortment of chests. Butterflies. Please don't kill them. At least the one I don't have. Mm. All right. In you go. More butterflies. And I think it's time for me to go fight Crab Yalon. But I shall do that in the next episode. This has been Disco Dogs, and I'll see you in the next episode.